Oh, too many times to count. <laughs> no, it's not true. But I, okay, a little bit of Russell Brand goes a long way to answer the first part of your question. Sure. So perhaps better in an ensemble, perhaps better in Rock of Ages, which is coming up, and uh, you know maybe more better suited for him. We might like him better as a voice of the Easter Bunny than a spoiled drunk. I think it takes a lot to pull off the part of Arthur, and I think it's a remake that didn't need to be made, back to our mm. former topic. Right, right. But then I want to tell a story very quickly. Does anyone know this, or is it urban legend, that Clint Eastwood and Burt Reynolds were studio players at maybe Warner Brothers, were fired in the same meeting by an executive who said to Burt, or who said to Clint, your eyes are too close together, and he said to Burt, and you can't act. And then when they walked out, Burt Reynolds said, boy, I feel sorry for you. And Clint said, why, you got fired too. And Burt said, well, I can learn to act. So <laughs> <laughs> the point is, Clint Eastwood and Burt Reynolds right. both went on to be superstars. Yeah. So, uh, you know, they build you up, they knock you down. They build you up, they knock you down. Who's to say? How many people have told you no, Kevin? Oh, well, every time you're, you don't get a job at an audition, that's a no. Yeah, so I would say two. <laughs> <laughs> you missed it. No, um... You know, you do have to have tough skin in this business. And, um, Too bad I don't. But Russell Brand is, uh, you know, I think the other thing about him is uh, he's got this English kind of a thing going. I don't know if he's really English. But, uh, and he's got a brand name, which is good. Uh, but, um, See what he did? I did. Uh, I took the thing, I twisted right. around a little bit, yeah, packed it, word it, tied it up, tied it up. Uh, I forgot what the question was. <laughs> <laughs> I, well, the, the, the idea, I mean, I would imagine, and I don't know if one has a, you know, you read Entertainment Weekly yeah. saying, you, you know, He's washed up. Russell Brand, a little bit of him goes a long way, and eventually he'll be able to find his way through it. He's like, like Jack Black is. I love Jack Black. I could watch him in anything, and it, when he's in the perfect role as a leading man, like School of Rock, he's absolutely perfect. And when Russell Brand was a part of an ensemble in the Forgetting Sarah Marshall movie, he was, he was excellent. And, you know, I mean, maybe, maybe the fact that he was doing a remake of Arthur is his big downfall, not the fact that he's not, right. you know, connecting with audiences or connecting with his co-stars. I mean, you know, maybe the stuff he's doing isn't top-notch. Uh,